What it do, guys? It's your girl, Kama Lexi, and I am here with We Serve Dope. What is We Serve Dope? We serve difference of opinions presented to educate in an entertaining way. An entertaining way. Yes, guys, it is here. It is here. The update that y'all been waiting for. I know it took me a while, guys, but I had to edit edit okay there's a lot of editing that need to be done with these things if these videos be long as shit you know what i mean so guys work with me work with me it is here it is here all right there's not much updates out there especially not on shell but we're gonna get through these videos here that i did find um just to give y'all a little refresher uh, update here on why we even here for those of you who don't even know who these people are okay i'm gonna show you um a few clips here i'm gonna give my commentary in between guys those of you who know know i comment in between the videos guys i comment in between the videos if you're not into that that is okay that, i'm not gonna be for everybody okay no animosity no hard feelings if this is it um for our journey together okay and that is okay hopefully we'll meet down the line sometimes but if we don't that is okay too all right you take care of yourself thanks for even clicking on the video okay for those of you who are okay with the shits okay and it's here to hang okay sit back relax and let's get into this foolery okay trigger trigger warning okay big trigger warning stay tuned to the end because i got a little song 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 for you i promise you you want to see it <laughs> i promise you you want to see it if ever you wanted to laugh if ever you wanted to see foolery at its best wait to the end i got you in jail, I'm so happy. Like, why am I still free? You said you're free because of no proof. I'm free because of no proof, but they got videos of me hitting her, correct? That's proof, sweetie. What do you mean, free because of no proof? They showed videos of me forcing her to eat dog food and hitting her during a live on Bigo, remember? So, how is it no proof? I'm confused. You guys have videos. Why are not I arrested yet? As you guys can see, guys, we already start with her being confused. <laughs> Why you get the money she making? Bitch, is you high? Bitch, why do you think because she's going to go... Let me get over here. Why would you think because she's going to go south that she need to keep the money? Um, Because maybe it's her vagina? <laughs> because she's going to put in the work? I mean, if that was the case, why didn't you have sex with the trick? Why didn't you make the money? You making her make the money? And you get to keep it. And this is not abuse. And you're not guilty of anything. Okay. First of all, it's my trick. Okay, man. That's number one. It's my motherfucking trick. Oh, hey. That's number one. Very funny, I guess. And like, yeah. like, you really look cute as shit, bitch. Period. Y'all don't even look like Michelle, bro. <laughs> Those of y'all who know that is not a real compliment. <laughs> she told her she looked cute as shit. She never tells Michelle she's cute, right? She always tells her she's ugly, okay? There's dollars involved here, okay? Because there's dollars involved, though she's the cutest B in the building. You feel me, girl? You look good, girl. Go ahead and get this money, girl. Yeah, honey. Let's get it. You look souping her up. And poor little Michelle. Poor little Michelle. Mm-hmm. What's your, wait, what's your name gonna be, bro? I don't know. I'll come up with a name. Just go ahead. Uh, Skylar. Skylar. Okay, you can do it. No, I don't like Skylar. Pop, be quiet. Um, we'll think of something. We'll think of something. Oh! Don't Michelle look pretty? Yeah. What's she look like? Um, she about to go trick. Yo! 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 Get the fuck out of right now. I'm not, yo! Get the fuck out of Yep, yeah, I heard him. <laughs> This is why he's like that. They do these things in front of him. You see, he saw exactly what they was doing. He get you getting her ready for a trick. So he, you asked her what she looked like, and he told you she looked like she a trick. I mean, Or just spray some perfume down there. At the end of the day, it don't fucking matter. It ain't like you're trying to marry the motherfucker. Just do what you gotta do and leave. Lord. Did she just tell her that her for JJ's thing? Y'all. 
Did she just tell her to have a JJ? Did she not tell her to take a shower before this trip? Never mind. Get that bread. Michelle, listen. Get that bread. Get that. Then leave. Mm -hmm. Then leave. Your neck to hop on Queen Out dick. Y'all mad at shit. She ugly. Be mad at that bitch. Be mad at her mama, her dad, not me, bitch. See? Now she's back being ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Go home, I am home. But I'm a bad person. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm bad. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And you are. You really are. <laughs> I'm glad you know it. <laughs> Cause you are. Listen, we did anything for clout when Queen I got tired of selling pussy. Yeah. It was a time in my life where I got tired of selling pussy. I, don't I got tired so, of stripping. Right. I got tired of setting the third. Like Michelle comes from a loving family. Michelle can go back home to any of her family members any given moment. Well, shit. Michelle's Did your mama block you yet? I don't know. I mean, fuck the money, fuck the fame. Show us you genuinely caring about your sister before money and cop was involved. How did y'all meet? How did y'all meet at, at ShopRite? Working together. <laughs> in in 2008. Store? In 2008. I took her under my wing well, shit. in 2008 when social media wasn't involved. Yes. We both wasn't on social media in 2008. Fucking 10 years before we started popping. Stop it, bro. 10 Stop years it. before we started popping. Stop it. We were friends before y'all even knew what an Instagram app was. Before Instagram was even thought about, we've been friends. We've been kicking it. My me. family employed Michelle. Always. My family, ain't, my family ain't do nothing wrong to Michelle. Multiple what are you talking times. about? That's why she take up for me and my family. Shit, my family real employed real her. Real my family had Michelle me. down there with waist trainers on, real titties shit. sitting up, ass fat, all that. What are you talking about, bitch? She treated me like I was Michelle's a family ain't never employed her. Hell, back in 2012 when I beat Michelle the fuck up for being unloyal, my sister called the cops on me, bro, because I was wrong. My sister, my Your blood, my sister. blood. My blood. Listen, That's hold on, wait, wait, hold on, wait, wait. Hold on, wait, hold on, wait. Will, 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 will. Blood mom, blood pop, bro. I mean, yeah, blood mom and blood and, and blood pop. My sister felt like I deserved to be, you know what I'm saying, for what I did. And I chalked it, you know, it is what it is. But my sister and my family had the best, you know what I'm saying, the best shit from a show. Yes. She, when I was locked up, my family, oh, you got my sister, bring you out. No, they had, they had a work in. Yes. My sister had my show with bras that fit. Stomach snatched, yeah. ass fat, waist, trainers, waist trainers. My sister had her living in a fucking mom and law suite in her Real crib. Shit. Like my 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 dad had Michelle working for his company for his business. Like Michelle family has never even employed this girl. That right there actually speaks volumes. It speaks volumes about Michelle. She's lovable. She's a good person. She's nice. They like her. Okay. They're telling you that you're wrong. So who's the problem? Right. You went, you got to arrest your own family called the cops on you because you was assaulting this girl. Mm. Okay, 2012. So you think you're not going to get in trouble? Guys, there's no way that this gloss is over if she already got a history. So for those of you who didn't know that, okay, she does already have a history. And she admits it here. And she also admits that her parents employed Michelle before. So Michelle was not, not working the entire time. Okay. Speaks volumes right there. They, Michelle family can't show y'all shit from nine years ago of what they tried to save Michelle. Eight years ago, save Michelle. Seven years ago, save Michelle. Six years ago, Ain't nobody save Michelle. No Nothing. I don't fucking get one. Nothing. Nothing. Looked out for me Nothing, bitch. Say, oh. That is shit. The facts is the facts, bitch. And I said what I said. Fuck Michelle mom. Fuck her dad. Fuck her sister. Fuck all them bitches. Michelle mom is a perk head. Michelle sister's a perk head. Michelle sister's a zaddy head. Michelle sister's a fucking alcoholic, bitch. Bullshit. Keep believing the words of alcoholics and drug addicts, bitch. I might be drunk right now, but I'm not dependent on no substance. I'm tipsy, but I'm not dependent. My every day don't depend on a substance, oh, bitch. Shit, Stop it. Seconds. Drug test me and drug test Michelle mom and sister. Stop it. Stop it. Girl, shut the fuck up. Ain't Stop it, ho. I ain't put my shit to you, bitch. Suck my dick. Thank Suck you. my dick, bitch. Suck my dick. Save Michelle from no, what? She want to be there. 
All right. That right there basically shows that Michelle is being brainwashed, okay? She's being brainwashed in the sense that she's putting in the forefront everything they do not do for her, right? Oh, you know, she claims she got family because remember at the beginning of the skit, she says she got family. She always got somebody to go to. But then now she's saying they ain't shit. They don't do shit for her. And they keep she keeps trying to drill that in her head like, oh, they ain't doing nothing for her. They ain't there. They ain't been there. They ain't this. They ain't that. You know, really freaking with the girl's ment you know, mental. Against her own family. This is sad. <laughs> you know guys. I take. The reason why I talk about this story so so much. And I'm going to keep it a bean. Why I picked it up in the first place. Is because I have four daughters y'all. Four. I got four daughters. And I'll be damned. If one of my daughters. Is one of the. Any of these girls. Neither one of these girls. I. I pray. All right. I pray. Because we don't know who, you know, according to to Michelle, she had a good upbringing, good parents. And she ends up in a situation like this. You know, according to, to, to the rumors, they were a family. She had a mom and she had a dad. Things went left. I don't know. What happened? Why Michelle feels whatever she feels against her family, right? But in the end, there were two parents in the home trying to raise this child. Who's to say, right? But either way, I don't like it. And, and I pray to God that neither one of my daughters or any of y'all daughters end up in this shit here. <laughs> Let's pray on it, y'all. <laughs> Dead ass. Guys, y'all see Michelle face though? She feel just like us. Disgust. What? Ew. She got the face like, what is she? Ew. In a cup. In her kitchen cup, y'all. In her kitchen cup. Did you see the pedo? Did you see the pee? It's certain things that you just don't need to put up here, y'all. It's just certain shit that just don't need to be. What the f What? <laughs> what the fuck? What was that, y'all? What? <laughs> what? What? That's what's under the wigs, y'all. She's so drunk, she she couldn't even sit up, y'all. You seen her? She lean. <laughs> oh my god! If you eat the sweet carrots, mommy will give you puffs. Mm. You know you love your banana puffs, right, Michelle? Don't touch it, or you're gonna get popped. Don't Me touch too. it. No puffs. Me too. No puffs. Me too. No, you have to eat your food. Wow, looks like she's a better pretend mommy than she is a real one. Want to see it? Here you go. I can't do all that on here. I can't show him, y'all. He's married. Do you want to just go in the car? Yo, do I look like a car, nigga, man? You don't want to wait? No, I ain't trying to wait. I ain't trying to be in the car. I, I was, um, what's the name? I'll, you know, smuggle it so won't leave, I won't leave no mess. You gonna swallow it? So I won't leave no mess. Cause you know I got the jag out there. <laughs> I got the Again, guys, this man is married. Married man here. Her trick is a married man. Get 
somebody. Yeah. I don't like you. Ain't gonna fuck my mind. <laughs> yeah. You know, you you guys, this is why I can't leave him alone. Pop, stop. Oh, no, no. Stop, Pop. Go in the room. Stop. Don't talk to my son. Stop. Chill out. Pop. Like, you had to steal my money when I saved up for fucking years. Huh? And then y'all stole money from a child. Pepper, finish it that. You should be working. You should be getting paid on Friday, drunk ass bitch. Instagram is a fucking job. Wrong. Right? You stop. Four. Don't get an actual job. Ah, right, you got an extra job. That's why my dad left you now. Your dad didn't leave me. Your dad didn't mean to get out of jail. Watch your mouth. I don't bail him the fuck out. Fuck you, dickhead. Your dad needs me to get yeah. out of jail. Not his other baby mom. He needs me. Remember that. Okay, so why are you leaving? Don't. That's what happens when you're famous. Thank you, female. John Gotti. Thank you. Trick him and tell him that you want to... The people be, people on Beagle is going to call CPS on you. Fuck CPS. <laughs> Thank you. Look at, Look, at <laughs> Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Look, look, look at her. Discipline don't mean abuse. Look. As soon as she touching, y'all gonna be calling the people on her. Mm. Your dad used to do that to you. Yeah, that's okay. Sometimes, sometimes, not a lot. That's only, that's only, that's only if I punch somebody in school. Can I do that to you? No. Thanks. <laughs> no, it's a good thought. Hey, look, that's the trick. Stop. I'm about to give you Benadryl. Stop. No, trick. Is your allergies bothering you? Hmm? Is your allergies bothering you? Yeah. A little bit? Maybe a little bit? Mm -hmm. I'm going to go get the Benadryl. Hold that, Michelle. No, 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 no. I love you. I love you too. Just... No. I'm okay. No, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> No, you're not okay. <laughs> I think your allergies are bothering you, right? Look at me. Your allergies bothering you? A little bit? Guys, there you have it. Proof is in the pudding. She didn't properly discipline him. She just called his name. Stop, stop, stop. You know, he cusses a lot. You know, he got a lot going on, you know, and I'm not judging. You know what I'm saying? Kids are tough these days. But you can't be on no platform here thinking you all of this, all of that, trying to control the whole grown woman and you can't even control your own child. That's insane. You look crazy out here. You think you got things under control, but you don't control what really matters, which is your own home, your own child, your own life. You can't keep your own kids. You can't raise your own kids. You can't, none of that. But you rather keep a grown woman and toot your own horn because you help her in a sense that if it wasn't for you, she wouldn't go to the gyno. If it wasn't for you, she wouldn't have did this. She wouldn't have did that. But what are you doing for your kids? The ones that matter. The ones that came out of you. <laughs> Just saying. Let's let's get into it. <laughs> Miss I <laughs> like what's like well let's get into it because that's you uh, 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 right so what about them children that's coming out of you won't you worry about that won't you worry about that trying to control somebody else's situation with their parents control yours with your kid what's up with that me I earned the title of a mother you want to know why I earned the title as a mother because I'm one of them women who going to do any and everything to feed my child mm -hmm. Some of y'all don't deserve the title as mothers because y'all, oh, I'm not going to suck. No, my life's about to be cut off. And the only option I got to make money is doing this. But I ain't going to do this because of my pride. Or I ain't going to do this because I'm afraid what other people are going to think about me. Come on now. So you, so pretty much you're letting society pick what you're going to do for your kids. Mm. For kids, she don't got, by the way. Because they ain't with her, right? They with their families, with their peoples. 
Yeah. But she earned the title of a mother, guys. <laughs> okay, y'all. So, off of those, right? Off of that. So, now we're going to get into a clip where we're going to hear mom speak, okay? We're going to hear, we're going to see mom and Shell speaking, and we're going to see the manipulation done in between, okay, guys? Check it out for yourselves. You're going to see how she's over her, basically speaking for her and, you know, basically setting the tone you know what i mean to me she's setting the tone you know just watch shout out to surviving queen op i got some clips off of there i just wanted to shout you out i'm grateful i just want to make sure i give you your credit okay surviving queen op i got some clips from her or him whatever you are we're not gonna steal from you we don't steal from each other in this house mm -hmm. i understand you know to put that out there like that that's unfair that's the that's, you know, going at my character now. Stuff for coming to my house and, and somebody taking something. I don't do that. I was just in the moment, Mom. That's just how I felt. All right, like I said, they told some kind of way. I, I could, you could talk to me, too. Mm -hmm. I'm not no stranger in the night. I'm not going to say anything that's going to be mean or try to hurt you. Okay. I'm still my daughter no matter what. Mm -hmm. Y'all hear the mama? Do y'all hear how genuine her voice is? Oh, Op don't like that. Oh, that's why Op got it in for. There you go. Do you hear that genuine concern, that voice in them, that mama? Do you hear it? Oh, that's why Op acting a fool. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's why I told you to call me. Man, shut your bitch ass up. Really show up your because you told me your fucking house thing. Really show up your because you told me your fucking, your maybe we shit in the living room, in the living room where y'all eat, that's my shit. Really why show up your that shit, I keep going, my mom? Because how do I know this information? Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. I'm the best thing that ever happened to your motherfucking daughter. I'm the best thing that ever happened to your daughter. Ever. Your daughter would have been still a fucking weird ass bitch on returns. Putting mm, on, 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 on motherfucking returns, bitch, if it wasn't for me. This would be your daughter, bitch. Stop playing with me. Are you done with this? Walk around to the right, just picking shit up. What they do? What they do? What they do? What they do? No, Put this shit back on the shelf. Your daughter would have been, been putting this, still putting this back on the shelf. Fuck are you talking about? The hardest thing your daughter got to worry about in life right now because of Queen Out is what games she want to fucking play there on that fucking damn near 80 inch flat screen TV that's hanging up on the wall. How's she fucking tweaking? Talking about? She's not tweaking. Uh, yeah, and she should be able to choose what goddamn game she want to play. She is out here doing the content with you. <laughs> what is free nowadays? Ain't shit free nowadays. She working for that shit too. She's doing content with you too, mama. And to be honest, she probably would have been better off doing returns than being at your shit. <laughs> She would have been better off doing returns and shit and going home to her damn mama. Right? Is right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Layla. Hold on. Hold on, though, Michelle. Hold on. Didn't your mom tell you she was proud of you? Yes. But how did you get where you are? Because of you. Stop fucking playing with me. You proud of your daughter because of the bitch you hate, though. Oh, but you want to accept the blessings that come from fucking with me, though, right? Y'all, y'all, Michelle family don't like me, but they want to accept it. They want to say, oh, we proud, we proud of you for what? Because she ain't do shit. That was all queen up. Fuck are you talking about? Stop. That's what I'm talking about. How was the all queen up? How was it all queen up? How? You degrading her. Yes, or you, the, the, the ideas that you putting out here, the degrading idea, the, all of that is you. But who's looking bad here? Even though you look like a, a fuck girl, okay? What about Michelle? Michelle is allowing this abuse. She's she's looking like an abused victim. Even if she's not, according to you guys, you got her looking out here like an abused victim. Even if she's not Stockholm Syndrome, don't have that, you making her look like she has that. Do you not understand? Stop playing with me. Put some fucking respect on my name. You ain't do shit. When, when I got your daughter, she ain't even know how to make a gynecology appointment. What we talking about? What we talking about? What we talking about? What we talking about? My responsibility. I ain't had to teach your daughter shit. I ain't had to do none of that. I don't get paid for this shit. This ain't no job. I know I only got one mother, but 
Like, mom's not always right. And it ain't. And ain't. And, ain't. and the fuck ain't. And ain't. Tla. What? That's what I'm saying. She don't like, know what she's talking that's about. A lie. She, they want to be over here that's so a bad. Lie. They want to be over here so bad, bro. Oh, such and such. Oh, her boyfriend is saying. First of all, Jules never hit you. Exactly. Like, and I never said he hit you. Well, so like just getting shit twisted. No, they're they're doing that shit for views and clickbait and all that shit. At the end of the day, bitch, like mind your fucking business, no, bitch. Let me... Where the fuck was you at when your daughter was being molested? Where was you at then? Where was you at? No, I'm calling her right now. Like, he never touched me. Like, <clears throat> I'm just calling to let you know that. Hello? Ain't... Hello? Yes, hold on one second. I'm here. This my, this, uh, I'm just calling to let y'all know that ain't nobody putting their hands on me. So it's not even. Wait, huh? I'm not posting nothing about you. Nope. You texting me talking about somebody putting their hands on me when they're not. What's all over line? Tell them you're wrong, bro. Tell them you're wrong. Like, this, like, do you not understand? Like, Girl, you ain't gonna do shit, bitch. You ain't gonna do shit. You had my address for a year. Bitch, you had my Eddie for a year. Bitch, you ain't never saw a hoe. You had my fucking Eddie for a year, bitch. You pussy. You pussy. I'm gonna break that fucking heart pace of bitch. I swear to God. I'm gonna break that fucking heart pace of She is talking to her mother, y'all. <laughs> She threatening her too. That's a threat. She gonna break her heart, Pacer? Like, you a bitch. Whew. Jesus fixed it. Again, I'm thinking about my daughters. You feel me? <laughs> like, she is cussing her mother out. She called her a hoe. She said she's pussy. She said she ain't going through shit. You bitch. You this. And Michelle is just sitting there. There is no way. If the issue is between me and you, whatever, I don't care what my mother feels, what my mother got to say. If my mother ain't speaking to you, you ain't going to be speaking to my mama. And even if she is speaking to you, you ain't going to be coming out with no cusses like this, calling her hoes and bitches. Especially if my mama ain't call you that. Fuck you doing that for? That's extra. She need her ass beat. She need, she need it. She need it. And this is why no matter how cool you with somebody, you shouldn't be telling them certain shit. Like, like she shouldn't have told her certain shit about her mama, her grandmama, all that. Like, all of that should have just been to her. Because, like, clearly this girl got, like, a temper. When she get mad, she throw everybody under the bus. And I'm pretty sure, Michelle, you know that already. So why are you telling her your business this deep? I don't know. I do get y'all was friends at one point. So I do get maybe this is when y'all were, like, cool, cool. Y'all, you know, might have had, like, nights where y'all was just expressing yourself. But in the end, y'all, please learn from this shit. Watch who you telling your business to. Because look how she just throwing her under the bus. First of all, now her mama knows that she really tells her business. Like, that's insane. Her mama probably didn't even think that of her. And she went and told the wrong motherfucker. She told the op, B. <laughs> Literally. What you talking about, bitch? Y'all, listen, I don't want to hear that tough shit. Y'all, I swear to God, bro. When me and Michelle first started popping on social media, bro, our that. address got leaked in May of 2020. Y'all know we just moved from Melrose Station's apartments. Michelle's sister and her...
her entire you family been had the Addy. But you go on the phone telling me you want to catch me. You had the Addy like you had the Addy. For a year. Am I lying? No. Am I lying? No. She had the Addy for a year. Yeah. So why are you saying when you catch me, you could have caught me? She talk a lot about her mother, but I guess they have something in common, which is... Uh, doing drugs if it's true that michelle's mother does do drugs perks or whatever this is okay um the difference between her and op's mom is op's mom was a crackhead she was a fiend so for her to go so hard like her mama wasn't a fiend is really insane to me but whatever we already know what we're dealing with here <laughs> yeah my crackhead mom get, get some beautiful jeans bitch that crackhead pussy was doing her do this though. that crackhead joint was doing her do this and I still, and I still love that Craig kid and would never not go to her funeral or her mom's funeral. What's up? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Woo! Right again, start, right again, stop. Thank you, Mel. Push that shit to the next box, though. I'm into that box. Push it to that box. Those of you who don't know, that was a shot to a Chanel because... Chanel, Shell, because she um convinced her not to go to her own grandmother's funeral. Okay, um, I don't know if anybody's seen that clip. I don't know if I put that in the last video, but there's so many clips, guys. There's a clip of her convincing her not to go with her, go to her grandmother's funeral. I'm gonna try to find that and insert that. Y'all not to call her back, but y'all can call her about a package. And this is what I'm saying. Y'all be screaming this family shit. Her family can call her about a, a, can call her to argue with us about a stolen package that they know they stole, but can't call her back about her dead ass grandma. I'm girl, shut up, girl, please. Nobody's making. Oh, I'm sorry, my fault. Like, come on now. Yeah, yeah people. But you can call to argue. To make excuses for my family. What Thank you. Is? Thank you for waking that up. Thank you. You can call about a about. Oh, you talking trash about me on social media. So that means you follow on our social media. Which we already knew that because y'all been stalking us since May of 2020. I mean, if I do go, which I'm up in the air right now, it'll be for my grandma. Like, it won't be for nobody else. I don't else think you should go. Home. I don't think you should. Like, why put yourself through all that stress? I want to go for my grandma, but I don't feel like dealing with drama. Honestly. Let me block some of these bitches. Get these bitches on my dick real quick. Hold on, y'all. Let me get these bitches on my dick real quick, y'all. And if y'all keep pissing me off, she's not going to that funeral. So I want everybody, come here, look at me. Come here, come here, come here. Hold up, come here. Come here. All right, come here. Come here. Come here. Mm. <laughs> I'm just powerful. <laughs> I'm so powerful. <laughs> I'm so powerful. Guys, seriously. Now y'all see why it takes me so long to make these videos. Ooh, you be wanting to go right through the screen. You just want to go right through that shit. You just want to choke a motherfucker. Like, what? This will be the last time she see her grandma? And you saying she can't go see her? Because you don't want her to? Because you want to feel powerful? You want to feel... She want to go, though. You could tell Shell want to go. You could tell Shell, you know, she's sad. She's sad. That's her grandma. I don't care who didn't call her or didn't, whatever. That's a personal relationship she had with her grandmother. If nobody called her or not, whatever relationship she had with her grandmother is between her and her grandmother. And she deserved to go see her damn grandmother. Like, who the f is you? And then the fact that you said that you would go see your own mama, but you... Whatever. Thank you, y'all know I got that fancy. Oh, let me, oh, let me show y'all my makeup, y'all. Hold on, y'all know I wear makeup now. Hold on, let me show y'all my makeup. Hold on. I know I'm gonna show grandma I'm dying, but hold on, y'all. Let me show y'all the drum real quick. What? <laughs> oh my God, you can't make this shit up. Oh! Michelle, don't turn the camera around because I got the same one. I don't know if I'm going, but I'm honestly thinking of I don't going to the room. Yeah, just maybe Because my thing is, hold up real quick. Didn't they just say it wasn't about them? Go for your grandma? So why do you stress me to go to the funeral when they know it's going to be drama there? If it's truly about your grandma, you can go visit her at her grave site. You don't have to be up in their fucking face. And be fake and let them talk shit about you. Your sister's trying to fight you. Because I'm not going to be there to protect you. So who going to help you? Who gonna help you if she start hitting Nobody. you? Exactly. 
So you want to trust going there without me and your sister and I put her hands on you? What you want to do? That's up to you. But don't come back here crying all that. Yeah, it is the last time I'll ever see her, but I don't feel like dealing with the other toxicity from other people. Exactly. And it's a shame that I should even have to think like that and mm -hmm. think that people won't put this to the side for that day, but... All of this is about Queen Op, and you know it. You know it. You know that's the real reason they ain't call you. Because they feel like you chose me over them. You not have to have a security guard to go be at a family member's funeral. Like, that sounds crazy. Exactly. Go get your phone. Block all that number. Go get your phone. I should not have to go have nobody with me to go to a family member's funeral. Is it that serious, though? She's making her block everybody's number. Everybody's. This is a, a, this is a, a, a power move for op this is a power move right here all the manipulation she's doing right here this is a power move this is like you know i'm here for you they not you know if you go by yourself you can get hurt you know don't go because i'm not going with you no nobody really got your back they couldn't even call you like the manipulation yo <sighs> no you got to block that number give me that phone give me that phone because i'm not gonna let them stress you out mm -mm. you already going through enough about your diabetes and all that you just got diagnosed with diabetes like, hold on real quick. You need to block all a number. Here, go in there and block all a number. They don't deserve to talk to you. They I'm going to ask you again real quick. When me and you stood on a fucking boulevard with a homeless sign, who was there? Was your family there? No, nobody. Was your sister there? No. Was your mother there? No. Were you calling an extra dad for $100? Was he fucking there? No. Stop playing with me. Don't talk to me about this family shit, bro. Do not do that. Don't do that. I think the reason why the family don't want to help her is because um, I believe they've helped her before. They've gotten her like a, a ticket before or something like this. And um, she went back to her. So I think what they want to do is help her out. They don't want to help her stay in. You know, they don't want to give her money to stay there. They want her to give up. You know, they want her to come with them. Um, they feel like that's a waste of money. I mean, like, I'm not about to give you money so you can stay with an abuser. Like, I'm not doing that. If you want to come home, I'll help you with that. But if you're trying to stay, I ain't helping you with that. I respect it in a way, you know what I'm saying? In a way, right? Because you do want to help your child. But then it's like, I'm not about to help you be abused and embarrass me. You all on the TV screens embarrassing me and shit. I'm not about to help you with that. So I get it. I get it. Bro, like, we done been through this shit before. We going to make it. Yo, get up. Come on, yo. Bro, like, we done been through. Motherfucker can't even call their family for $20. Stop playing with me. Motherfuckers probably was secretly getting a slow check for this bitch the whole time. And y'all wanna... That's why she this old and don't know what the fuck wrong with her. She don't know where to start. The girl is stressed out. Michelle learned more with me than she ever learned being with her original family. True. And that's why she's changing her name next week. If I didn't have important stuff to handle this week, we would have handled it this week. But I got tied up and I got sick and all it. But next week, she's changing her last name. So you ain't got to worry about her embarrassing the family name no more. You I really do feel like she should see her grandmother one last time. I really feel like she should not. Why should she? Really? Why, why she should go there with that type her, of sister? She can see her grandmother when she but gets her the rest. She can go but her grandmother's her grandma not her in the... Time. Her grandmother's her, gone. What is she going to the funeral for? There's no spirit in that body. The body is empty. So what the fuck is she going to her funeral for? Let's speak on it. It's her grandmother's gone. What the fuck do she need to really go to the funeral for? Her soul is not there. She can go do the same shit she wants to do at the funeral at on her own personal time. When she's ready to go cast, see her she grandmother, just she shouldn't have to be rushed. You see what I'm saying? I, I see what you're saying, but it's still her grandmother. Her grandmother's not in the drama, right? Her grandmother. No, her grandmother not in the drama, and I ain't even got no problem with the grandma. And that's the only person I did like. Is you know what I'm saying? Other family that I don't fuck with. You know what I'm saying? But and that speaks volume itself. That speaks for itself. That's the only person you fuck with. Why can't she go see her grandmother one last time? Because it's going spirit to be drama no that I'm going to have to deal with. It's going to be drama that when she comes back home, I'm going to have to deal and piece the puck back together and get her out of depression or whatever. The mess they're going to create when she goes to that funeral, Queen I was going to have to be the one to snap, bring her. Snap out of depression again, like I always do. So the well, what if y'all set up like a special? I have to clean up. That's what if you set up like a special? Going behind the scenes, that ain't none of y'all business. <laughs> what if y'all set up like a, a special viewing or something? Boy, we ain't doing a special viewing. Have a good motherfucking day. What's up? 
I'm going to say this respectfully. I've been away from my family. I moved to another state um, 40 some years ago. Um, when my, I can see the pain and the hurt in Shell's eyes. Um, it's because when my grandparent passed away, I went to the wake before anybody else got there. So I didn't have to deal or see any of them. But I feel like she should go because she might regret it later. What is she going for? It's her grandmother. That will her grandmother be there? Will her grandmother her be there? What is she, she going for? Her but there's nobody there, bro. Y'all can't I, want her to like. It's nothing there. What's she going to go see a body and be more upset? Saying this respectfully, when I went, I went because I knew I would never see my grandma again. And listen, so I going went there, you're still never going to see her again because she's not there. You went there to no. see your grandmother one last time, but she was not there. That was an empty body that she was hyped to go see. But I'm glad I did it. And and what did it do for you? Nothing. Because you're still talking about it to this day. So clearly you didn't get the closure you needed. No, I did actually. But I'm just saying if I feel like if I did. Okay, but I your, is your family toxic? Is Shout out to these two callers here who had some sense. Okay, and tried to give her some. But unfortunately, you can lead the motherfucker to the water. But you can't make him drink. <laughs> yeah, I tried though. Kudos to y'all. Y'all did that. Y'all did that. <laughs> but she ain't having it. Queen Nop don't give a shit about nothing because she's a true narc. Narcissists don't give a shit about death. All right? That's real talk. All right? They don't give a shit about death. Um, somebody had wrote a comment um, and tagged me. I, I saw it. I just can't remember your name, okay? Um, it's a female nar narcissist. She has her own content. And... Um, she speaks of that and I commend her for even putting herself out there and um and, and keeping it a bean about nar narcissism, right? Being a narcissistic and actually speaking on it. That's that's lit. You know what I mean? Giving us the warnings and shit. And she spoke on this, something about narcs are not sensitive to death like we are. Like, you know, um they know it hurts us. So it, it, it they really use it instead of, you know what I mean? Like it's a play for them. You know what I mean? And it's sad. It's real fucking sad. It's sad. But yeah, you can go to the funeral if you want. I know I can go if I want, but it's not about me. It's not about somebody saying, oh, you can't, you can't go somewhere. It's about the toxicity. You're not wanting to be bothered with it. So you don't think you just, I mean, just think about it. I've been thinking about it and I'm still on the fence about it. You sure? You sure? Sure what? I mean, this the final decision or you just not sure yet? I'm just not sure yet. And then, and then, and, and then, and then let me wake up something else. Mm -hmm. I'm trusting you to go to this funeral. How I know you're not going to secretly give your mom the address so your mom sickly can know where you at? Like you did at my station. Don't I think do. I didn't know. I never said anything. Cause I knew it was gonna wake itself up eventually, like it did. I didn't. But they didn't. Your mom, but your mom until... and them was pressuring you. Oh, we just want to know where you at in case and anything happened. I wasn't happened. telling them what, nothing. What you I wasn't telling them nothing. So that day, your mom took you from the train station. I mean, picked you up from the train station. You ain't tired where we lived there. No. Guys, my confession for the day. Okay, Lord, I don't like her. I don't. I don't like her. Okay? Miss Op, I don't like you. Not that you care or anything, but I'm sharing this with the world. Bitch, I don't like you. I don't like you. What's up? Call your mom and tell her you're done. You're disowning her. And tell her I'm your new mother. Okay. If you're her, if... We know that was her mom because the person had her picture and when we added the person, it was her voice. And when Michelle called her, she was on the phone. So what do you mean? She said with the millions of people, they said you're brainwashed. First of all, don't say How? brainwashed because I didn't make her call. She How? called her mom on her own. Because her mom, first of all, brainwashed about what? There's nothing to be brainwashed about. Michelle, when you say it like that, it makes it seem like the it true? is. true? There's nothing to be brainwashed about. Anything I've said on social media has been true. 
anything that has been done on social media besides the mirror, I don't regret. I don't regret none of that. I don't regret nothing. I've done nothing I said besides that one. First of all, you bitches can say whatever y'all want to say. At the end of the day, it's our real motherfucking life, bitch. And ain't shit a motherfucking storyline about a bitch disrespecting her mom. So you can say what you want to say, bitch, okay? I I know y'all wish it was a storyline that she's choosing me over her family, but it's not. Okay? Like I said in the other room, Queen's mother, I will go to before I go to my own. Hmm. Tell them you're taking my last name and this is the last time they'll ever hear from you again. Mm -hmm. Oops, sorry. Hey, I'm just um calling you to let you know that I'm done dealing with all the stress that this family has caused in my real life. I'm just done. Like this is the last time you will hear from me. And I'm taking Queen's last name. And I mean it from the bottom of my heart. The reason that I did grandma's funeral is because I didn't want to deal with y'all. It had nothing to do with grandma. It had nothing to do with nobody but y'all in that family. That's the reason that I didn't come to her funeral. Because I didn't want to be dealing with y'all. For however long that was going to take. And I'm just done. Like, seriously. Guys, again, you see Shell's face. She didn't want to do that. She didn't want to do that. She didn't want to do that. No matter how much she did it, y'all could see her expression. She didn't really want to do that. That's sad. This is so sad, guys. <laughs> This is so sad, guys. Oh. Good. Mm -hmm. Why are you smiling at me? As you see, she is happy and thrilled and trolling. So I wouldn't even get mad. Uh -huh. I wouldn't even get mad at all. <laughs> if you see by her looks, it's just... You should really see how she looks off camera. <laughs> yeah. Get the fuck out my house. Get the fuck out my motherfucking house. <laughs> he ain't lying though. <laughs> And another thing, did you see how he's trained too? Because he's like, you might as well not be mad. She happy. Look, she happy. She trolling. She happy. You you might as well not even get mad. Because look, at least she happy. So you can tell he's trained too. He's trained to watching this shit, right? To keep, you just got to keep mommy happy. Do the bullshit just to keep her happy. She, she like the bullshit. She like trolling and shit. We got to do what she say. Even he know that. That's why he be trolling her too. Ugh. Phone call didn't hurt for the person that said they hurt. Their last phone call. She didn't hurt, hurt and about to cry because she know she did wrong. No. How was she did wrong? No. We wasn't bothering Michelle family. They came over here bothering us. What? No. At the end of the day, I do more for her than her own mother. Yes. That's why I'm her mother. Where's your bank in your bed? She's still not staying. <laughs> Michelle! You're going with your dad. I'm going to get you a toy. You call? 
Is none of y'all cold? I have to pay her back for going in Hawaii. I'm not letting her go into her going home. What are you doing? I think I'll dismiss her when I'm done with her. Is that what I'm done with this water bottle and throw it in the trash? Something. Again, there you go. For those of y'all who don't believe that she's doing this purposely, how much more proof do y'all need? It's so clear right there. <laughs> like there's no more proof needed right there. It's right there. She said it. Now, I don't know why she feel like Michelle messed up her life. Because <clears throat> she controls her own shit. But now she's trying to destroy Michelle. You see that? She's trying to damper her relationship with her family. She didn't let her go see her grandmother. And now she's causing drama between her and her mama. Do y'all see it? And her sister. Do y'all see it? Do y'all see it now for yourselves? For those of y'all who are out here like, oh, she grown, she grown, da 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 She's the manipulator. She got a feeling like she's the only one who loves her for real. She got her feeling like everybody else treats her like shit. She the only one who's really there for her. Because at the time she do do her hair. Or do feed her. Or do do whatever she do for her. And in the same breath she'll do her hair and then pull the wig off. And in the same breath she'll give her food in a fucking dog pack. You feel what I'm saying? For those of y'all who just don't understand what's happening here. This is a true narc manipulator right here. True demon. And she's admitting that she's trying to destroy this girl's life. In front of her son. She just offered her son $20 to keep quiet. Because her son wanted to snitch that she was doing that behind her back like that. She offered her son $20. They didn't offer. She said, I'm going to give you $20. And it shut him right up. She's teaching him how to keep secrets. How to be mean. How to do shit behind people back. How to be a bitch. How to be an asshole. How to be a lot. All types of shit she's teaching her son by doing this shit. Like what? Oh my God. Oh my god I be having to calm down yo I, Listen 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 I gotta be done son This video is almost done Hey If somebody can't shut me $100 right now I go I go to Rite Aid Buy a fucking drug test And piss on that bitch on camera I will piss on that bitch on camera Let, Let's see you piss on it on camera Let's see you piss on it on camera You probably killed your fucking mom for them perks Cause you wanted her script you want you wanted you wanted your mom's script. You know what I'm saying? You a weird ass bitch. You don't like me, but you want my clout, huh? You don't like me, but you want my clout, huh? What's up? No, I'm not going deep, bitch. Don't don't put no fucking drugs on my name, bitch. Fuck, I ain't nobody stronger on drugs but you. Oh, we got proof of that, sweetie. We got proof of that. You a clout chasing ass old head. Doing... She, she could threaten us all she wants. She mad. She I got a daughter with a fucking binky on her mouth, bitch. I win. I win. I got your daughter with a beak in her mouth. Stop playing with me, bitch. Stop playing with me. I win. I win. That's a bitch right there. That's a bitch right there. That's a bitch. Ooh, if I ever seen one, honey. How you win? How you win? How you win? You look stupid. You look dumb. And Michelle look even dumber. Y'all both look stupid. Y'all both look dumb. Y'all don't get no, 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 no clout for this shit. And the people who do give y'all clout for this shit, they just as stupid as your ass. Y'all stupid. This is stupid shit right here. This is stupid shit. Y'all doing this for views and clicks and shit? Like, this is stupid shit right here. And y'all, ooh. Ooh. Um, you lost your mom and your daughter. Oops. 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 You talking about the family name and legacy. Your son hit bitches. Why ain't your son just booked for his fucking... Should we wake that up? They talking about the family legacy. Wake it up. What family legacy? Wake it up. Bitch, y'all wasn't even known before we out. Hold on, hold Y'all what, bitch, you wouldn't even be known if it wasn't for me, bitch. What are you talking about? Only known for what? Girl, it don't matter what somebody's only known for. You're they're here. Known. It don't matter we're known, bitch. You here paying the fly stuff across the screen. So yeah, I win. You're mad. You don't have anybody now. And your other daughter's not gonna be around because she has a heart pacer. Yo. 
Yo, you gotta be real evil. You, you, this is the devil. This is the devil. I'm gonna take that fucking battery out that bitch. Girl, shut the fuck up, ho. Like I said, uh, let me be coked out, baby. I still have your daughter, and you don't have your daughter or your mom. So you're really lonely. That's why you coming on here and all of a sudden. you get. I get it now. This is why she's coming over here, because she's lonely now. She Leave been, me alone. You, she been stealing your grandma's perks all this time, and your grandma haunting that fucking house. The gag is, sweetie, that if she's indeed with her family, because that's what the update is with her, right, guys? There's no real anything uh, new, right? The, the whole thing, the whole update with Shell is that she's with her peoples, right? She's good with her peoples, right? So do you really win, sweetheart? Maybe you did for a second. But now you're the loser, baby, the big time loser who's definitely going to reap some type of karma coming your way, sweetheart. Not some type. You've already reaping. I just wanted to put a clip here of uh, the sister. All right. Shell's sister had an interview and she's going to explain more or less uh, her sister's personality. We're going to get it straight from the sister. What Shell really is like prior to uh, Sierra and what she really is personality wise and who she was before all this shit. Let's get it. That right there debunks Miss Op because she's always calling her ugly and telling her, don't nobody want her. It's not my fault that the guys don't look at her when they when we walking down the street. They look at me. They don't look at her. But in reality, the girl been pulling niggas. OK, and not only that, she's not an ugly girl. You see, when Queen Op does her wigs, she's cute. It's she looks cute. She's not like a but ugly girl. She's cute to me. She's cute, especially when she clean up nice. She can be cute. That's all mental. She's beating her down to make her feel like she's not cute. And that's what's making her ugly. That in confidence, that no confidence that she has, that she used to have, which you clearly could see when they first became friends. You could tell she had slight confidence. It may not have been a big confidence, but she had confidence. And I feel like her getting beat down and manipulated changed all of that. I wonder what those friends are thinking now about her. I wonder how they feel about Shell. I mean, I, I wonder how her friends feel. She had a lot of friends. I wonder how they feel now. Her sister is so hurt. Her sister is hurt, y'all. It's okay, sis. You can say he bad. You can say he a bad little mom. You can say it, sis. We already thinking it. <laughs> We already see it. <laughs> you just confirmation, sis. Thank you. <laughs> Guys, I found the clip that she was talking about with the we ain't Muslim no more. However, this is just a part of it. It turns out that there's a little bit more to it where they start cutting up the things that they wear over the head okay i guess after this part they end up like cutting it up singing we ain't muslim no more they end up cutting off these kufis or whatever they're called i'm sorry if i'm saying that wrong but they ended up taking a scissor and cutting them in that in that clip i just happened to get a little piece of it i didn't find that full one but you, just so y'all can see Now, I don't know what's that thing that you put on your head. Turban, I think. Is it a turban? I don't know, guys. Y'all yeah, let me know what it's called down below. But she has on one of those. And we all know that Muslims is not supposed to show skin. Like, hair nor skin. Now, she has on the head thing. The tie. But she's naked. In her bathing suit. Like, what? Oh, my God. So disrespectful. Guys, y'all hear that? Do y'all hear that? All right, I try to let it play, y'all. I try to play, let it play a little while. Listen, as y'all heard, Sierra went to jail before for putting her hands on her. We already know that part, right? Back in, what, 2012 or something like that, right? She went to jail for a whole month. Her peoples got a train ticket for her to come back, and she still want her ass back when Sierra got out. So there's already charges. So Sierra is definitely going to face some charges. My thing is, yo, Michelle is with family right now. So I'm hoping that they get this tight grip on her this time. Okay, I hope that she she's dealt with enough to know that this is not what she wants. 
right? From 2012 to now, you know, she's dealt with a whole bunch of shit from the media, from Shell, from Danny, from from everybody, all angles, right? Even Lil Pop be disrespecting her, right? So I hope that all of this is enough for her to stay away, Michelle. Stay away, baby. She did it once. She's doing it again. This time she's allowing somebody else to do it to you. You need to stay away, mamita. That's the best thing for you, homegirl. Look at the difference, okay? Look at the difference in health and in happiness. Okay? Nobody's striking you. At least that we know of, right? I can't wait for some type of update to come out, like a, another update of her, like a, a good one, Okay? All we know is that she's with her peoples. That's all we know. And and for us, that's good enough. But we just want confirmations. You know what I'm saying? That she's there and she's going to stay there. Sierra about that pop that baby out soon. It's, 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 everybody's world is about to change. Real talk. Everybody's world. feel her i feel her on that i'm telling y'all i'm telling y'all it be taking me forever to make these videos i'm telling y'all There you have it, guys. That was the sister's interview. Guys, um, as you know, she said that all of this is very real. The abuse is very real. Um, the things that she say about the family, not so much. Um, she also states that the diabetes isn't real. Um, she never had COVID or diabetes. Um, she has friends. She's a bubbly person. Um, she does act different when she's around the family. You know, all of that, right? So these are confirmations and information that we wanted um to we, we we inquired we wanted to know so uh for those of you who inquired there are your answers from the sister's mouth all right i do agree with her that um it happened way too long on these apps like they didn't um if it wasn't for people reporting it these apps would have allowed it for whatever however long you know and i do agree that if this was a man oh yeah charges would have been they, it wouldn't have lasted this long you know it wouldn't have been a joke it wouldn't have been a key key ha ha it would have been funny right they would have took it a lot more serious you you know, especially from a woman who has already done this before. She's already been reported for doing this before. Right. So, yeah, um, you guys heard it from the sister's mouth here, guys. You know, um, I think I'm going to make another video more about Danny and Op. OK, one more video. I'm a, a little bit of update on them, more on them. OK, that, I, that one won't be so long. Uh, this one, I just wanted you guys to see the manipulation that she's done to her, right? Trying to separate her from family and all that nonsense she's been doing to her. So this was more for that. Guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Please give me your opinions down below. She's still with her peoples, guys. She's uh, she's well. She's fine. I'm hoping for a new update on that. Uh, hopefully soon it'll come out. And if it ever does, I will keep y'all posted on that. But guys, thank you guys for all the new subscribers. Let's get it. Let's go. All the new subscribers. Good looking. Good looking. All of you who's been leaving comments. All of you who's been showing love. Hitting the likes. All that. I am so grateful. You have no idea. I hope you really enjoyed the video today, guys. Again, please leave your opinions down below. Let me know what y'all thinking. I appreciate y'all so, so much. You've gotten my opinion, and you've been served. I'll catch you on the next one. Later. I ain't forget. I ain't forget. Here's your little surprise. It's a bonus clip. Enjoy. <laughs> Never fuck a broke Look, nigga holding out his hand. I'm in Philly, no cheese steak. Got the check.
to the next day. Petty face, so I'm up late. Just up. to let them know I'm in route. She keep my click in her mouth. She don't really like click. Go suck a dick, you freak bitch. I'm from the South. I'll flip no Odell, but I'll back him to bleach. No Odell, but I'll back him to bleach. I know you feeling shitty. You hating, you silly. I'm chasing after Millie. Stop calling, I'm busy. Like for real, no kizzy. I'm not checking for you, nigga. Please get out your feelings. Why you hating in my comments? Ain't no money there. You should go and get you some with your bummy ass. If you died, even your mama wouldn't fucking care. Hating online all day, bitch. You should be embarrassed. Be a whole sick, I'm Dejanay. Fuck Mexico, bitch. We in the States. Queen I, I'm hoodie blame. Fuck baddies where I stay fucking lame. Fuck I'm so pretty that she wanna fuck my boyfriend. Let's go. Pretty, privileged, you bitches ugly. Pretty, privileged, you bitches ugly.